टेक फेस्ट मतलब टेक्नोलॉजी का फेस्ट है एंड फेस्ट मतलब फेस्टिवल अब टेक्नोलॉजी का फेस्ट का मतलब ये नहीं है कि इट विल ओनली हैव कोडिंग प्रोग्रामिंग एआई गैजेट्स आई विल टॉक अबाउट सम यूनिक एडवांसमेंट्स व्हिच आवर कंट्री हैज मेड इन द फील्ड ऑफ स्पेस टेक्नोलॉजीज वेल आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट इसरो द इंडियन स्पेस रिसर्च ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड इसको मैंने विटनेस कराया एट आईआईटी बॉम्बे टेक फेस्ट एंड आई रियली वांटेड ऑल ऑफ यू गाइस टू नो अबाउट दिस पूरे टेक फेस्ट में ऐसा स्टॉल कहीं नहीं था व्हिच अट्रैक्टेड ऑल एज ग्रुप चाहे वो स्कूल के बच्चे या वो कॉलेज के बच्चे क्यों ना हो दे वर ह्यूमंगस क्यूज ट्रस्ट मी गाइस लाइन 1 किलोमीटर लंबी थी एंड नन ऑफ देम वर डिसहार्टेंड मैं इससे ज्यादा बोल नहीं सकता नाउ लेट्स स्पीक टू समवन हु नोस बेटर देन ऑल ऑफ अस गाइस आई एम एट इसरो स्टॉल इन आईआईटी बॉम्बे टेक फेस्ट एंड हियर इज जॉय अमाउंट टू एक्सप्लेन everything here yes what you are seeing here is the success story of isro okay. we have put uh, different launch vehicles you are seeing here gslv mark the latest one the fat bio of isro gslv mark 2 and gslv there which is the workhorse of isro okay. it is the only satellite which is launched mangalyaan made india the first country to go reach uh, mars and then the satellite which has launched one not four satellites in one go uh, yeah one not four satellites 2017 february and it was the only country was lost those many satellites and it was launched in different orbits out of 104 102 were foreign satellites so that's a faith developed countries that's a faith all the entire world had in indian program that was launched by jslv no pslv pslv polar satellite launch vehicle so okay. that was launched by pslv c37 in february 2017 pslv stands for polar satellite launch vehicle used to launch polar satellites or remote sensing satellites what you are seeing here they revolve around the earth from north to south north and they are used for earth observation the data what they send we have we make images out of it you are seeing these images they are of that the next group of uh, launch vehicles is gslv that is geostationary launch vehicles they are much capable and ca- can carry 4 tons to 6 tons of satellites to a very high altitude of 36000 km above the earth surface above the earth. and used for communication for navigation for your gps meteorologic applications cyclone warm, uh, warning all those we are using this group of satellites and uh, any example uh, which is also gslv marks gisat risat gisat all uh, your insat satellites started oh, from yeah. insat 1a 1b and that recently gisat group of satellites all communication satellites you are using you are taking my interview using mobile yeah. all that is made possible because of those geostationary satellites okay and uh, then you are seeing here uh, rlvd that is reusable launch vehicle technology demonstration that is up, uh, upcoming research how we can recover the set entire and launch this vehicle is not, back uh, this is not developed yet this is not yet developed by india Okay. Other all things what in GSLV you are seeing all the stages the cryogenic engine everything is indigenous developed by India each and every bit is now made in India. I, 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 I am so proud of that everything in Israel is made in India. Yes, these, yes everything is indigenously developed and uh, this is the Gaganyaan uh, upcoming mission of ISRO. in which uh, it is uh, 2023 it is planned the unmanned mission where first the robots will go to the space 300 km above the earth surface and gaganyaan will be on some planet no no it is in the uh, in space only it is not a interplanetary mission uh, these crew members will go to space as this poster also explains they will spend 3 to 7 days in the space 300 km above the earth surface okay. and then it, it will land back once we gain the success in it and then confidence then two to three two or three crew members already everything is decided training is also completed okay. they will be going to space spend some time and come back so this is the upcoming mission of isro gaganyaan then followed by as uh, our mission aditya you might have heard about sun and all those yes. things then these are the pic- some of the pictures remote sensing images how they look like because when the satellites are launched into the space yes. they send data to us we have earth station at shadnagar uh, i'm from nrc hyderabad so we have a earth station shadnagar we have we have antennas and live data is uh, is captured it is processed and make into a user understandable format and how many satellites are there in the space indian satellites right now 37 Uh, remote sensing current. satellites currently and 17 uh, uh, communication satellites thank you so much it was so nice talking to you aaj tak to maine ye sab is school ke books mein hi padha tha but jab maine isko apni aankhon se dekha my mind was blown away aur aise mind blowing videos ke liye technify ko subscribe karna mat bhulna